Welcome back, folks, and uh, welcome to the new Booze by Rob production facility here in uh, historic Nashville, Tennessee. Uh, sorry I've been away for a little bit. We've been preoccupied by uh, contractors and plumbers and granite people and cabinet people and all kinds of stuff. So life's been a little crazy, but we've got a great cocktail for you today. Super simple. It's four ingredients. A couple of them are a little on the strange side, but this one's worth it, and I'd recommend it. It's called the Doberman. Doberman is a cocktail that is actually pretty recent. It dates back to 2018 from an Australian bar. So we stole it from the Australians, and we call it our own. So here we go. We have a bourbon. This time I'm using Maker's Mark 46. Maker's Mark 46 is Maker's Mark. It goes through a secondary agent. It's one of my favorite bourbons that's very affordable, too, and you can find it. Um, here's one of your weird ones, uh, Fernet Branca. This is one where you try it by yourself and you go, ooh, I don't think I'm going to like this in anything. And then you try it in a cocktail and be like, oh, there's something to that. Thirdly, we have Sweet Red Vermouth. Uh, pick your brand, doesn't matter. And then lastly, uh, another kind of strange one that's a little expensive. This is Benedictine. Um, Maybe a smaller bottle until you decide if you like it or not, but it's a good one. This is uh, a simple cocktail. We're going to go into our mixing glass that has ice in it. We're going to use an ounce and a half of a bourbon. It doesn't have to be this bourbon. It's just one that we, we enjoy. Um, also, this is a new piece of equipment that we're going to talk about coming up. And I got a new bar set and uh, pretty cool. And it's not visky. How about that? We're going to use half an ounce of the remaining three. So half an ounce of Benedictine. One, there we go. Half an ounce of our sweet red vermouth. And then the interesting one, Fernet Branca. Half an ounce. So it's an ounce and a half of bourbon and a half an ounce of all the following. So. We're going to give it a stir in our mixing glass. Dilutes a little bit, cools the cocktail down without having ice that goes into the final cocktail. That should do us. And then, this is a whiskey. This is a whiskey Nick and Nora glass. Uh, it's one of my favorite glasses. Not sponsored by the whiskey company at all. I think they make really cool glasses. So, with our Hawthorne strainer, into a Nick and Nora glass. Oh, right to the top. Thank goodness. All right. Ooh, we have an issue. Well, folks, here you go. The Doberman. And yes, we're going to have to do this. Damn, that's good. We found this cocktail, and I think we had three of them each. You know, production staff, they get going, and it was hard to say no. But here we go. The Doberman. And welcome. We'll give you a tour around once we get everything complete, but we want to give you a little taste of what we've been up to. Take care, folks. Stay safe. Enjoy it. That's lovely.